In an effort to prepare for the hurricane season, we pulled out our generator to make sure everything was ready and in good shape. Even though it looked pretty good, after taking a closer peek, we noticed some damage to the spark plug threads. Since the damage wasn't severe enough to need a full rethreading or helicoil treatment, making our own spark plug thread chaser saved us a trip to the store and some money. Today we'll be going through how to do this step by step, but first, you're going to need an old spark plug of the same size with good threads, a Dremel or some other rotary tool, a socket that fits your spark plug, thick grease, shop towels, and of course, always wear proper eye protection and gloves. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to cut four grooves in here, and essentially what I'm doing is I'm taking my spark plug and I am creating a tap. So I've got four grooves. Now these aren't quite as wide as a regular tap set, so we'll see if these work like it is, and if it doesn't, we'll widen them up. All right, so the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna apply a good coating of grease on this, and that's because we're gonna be cutting at least a little bit of new threading in there trying to get this back in order, and we want the grease to grab a hold of any metal shards. We don't want it falling in there, so that will, uh, mess up your engine slowly if there's a little bit in there more quickly if you put a lot of metal shards in there so we want to avoid that and there are plenty of automotive greases out there for sure uh, this is actually uh, bicycle grease because you know what i like to ride my bike a lot and it's what i have handy in the garage right now so I got my greased up homemade spark plug tap and we'll go ahead and put this in and we'll see if it works. Let's make sure we got our socket on the right way first. All right. All right, let's see if it's cutting. Well, we've certainly made some progress in there, so I'm gonna finish this up and then we'll see if it works. All right, looks like we got a good fit. All that's left to do is test it and see if it worked. On our generator spark plug repair, the engine cranked up right away. Now keep in mind that this life hack won't fix every job that needs a repair, and you should definitely contact a mechanic for severe damage. But if you do decide to give this a shot on your own, let us know in the comments below if it worked for you. Hey, help us out by subscribing to the channel below and tap that bell to get notified when we post new tool reviews and shootouts. And as always, thanks for watching.